Hi, and welcome to Daichin's Daily Dharma, episode 14. And I'm in, still in Padua from my last episode, and I'm here with Anna Kutsevich from the LA Yoga School, Yoga Love Padua. <laughs> LA, LA Yoga School, Yoga Love Padua, exactly. Yes, Yoga Love Padua. And uh, yesterday we had a fantastic walk to the Observatorio del Galileo. And we found the location of tree yoga. Or we want to talk a little bit about tree yoga. Is there anything? Tree yoga love. Tree yoga love. Is there something you would like to say before we show the video to the YouTube public? Yes. So I think that uh, the tree is something so uh, one should... If you, so if you want um, to succeed in yoga, it's quite important to, to have this contact to nature. Yes. And the tree, this is something that is like, it's a holy being that can give you very much energy. And uh, so, you know, it's a long time ago that I started to do this tree yoga. And um, like, it's my, it's my daily routine. So I do yoga on trees. Tree yoga. Okay. Keep an eye out for uh, tree lizard and tree compass. Okay, so really nice for compass pose uh, and uh, lizard pose variations on the tree. And we'll be right back after this video. All possible stretches, no? This one. Like, no, if you want. Or sometimes I do this also like for, like, to improve the flexibility of my shoulder. Mm -hmm. Which is not, um, like, you know, I have the shoulder problem. Yes. Yeah, the tree is very healing. No, and this one the tree is, is your friend. You see, it has this shape, which is like it's a very natural uh, yes. yoga probe. Yes. So you see, I have this tree I is a. Uh, first, so I come and start with this with the left leg, this bridge, then with the right leg. And I do, the second I do all this, uh, this one. Mm -hmm. okay. Lizard, tree lizard. Yes, tree lizard. <laughs> so for both legs. It's like putting the foot up on a yoga block. Exactly. And then I always do um, like a variation of bound. Because it's also, you know, it's very nice because it's untypical um, uh, situation. You know? stretch here because I can open like the chest better and press a little bit against the tree no and I'm um, I'm not in a normal position where my right foot is on the floor yes because when it's on the floor I can't like yes because there's more it. it's, it's, you know, it's there's different. more gravity in yeah. in the foot yeah, standing it's foot in the back foot that's graha yoga <laughs> it's just being lazy and stepping up on a prop or tree. Exactly, exactly. And then I finish that. Now I stretch this one. Okay. And I do. Um, so the second part, I do always uh, some twists here on the tree. Mm -hmm. Because here I can, I can also, you know, I fit my. Like it's also very, very much Graha Yoga. With that one, because I press also this ankle back. Mm -hmm. Now and I can. Like. It improves very much my flexibility, and then I do also a bound. I can't do now because I'm too tired after the workshop. And like I repeat with the other leg, like everything from the, the beginning, because the other uh, on the other side I don't have a problem on with my shoulder. Like I stretch, and then I always like, take this the, the outside. And it's like for me preparation for compass, you know, because and then I start to press against the tree to lift that leg up because I can't lift it when I'm not on the tree, you know. And when I'm on the tree, I can can lift it up, you know. <laughs> You're making videos. Well, that was a great video. Uh, thank you so much for watching. 
And uh, thank you so much to Anna for every for hosting me here in Padua and for teaching me tree yoga, okay, tree compass and tree lizard and other variations of shoulder therapy. Some very good um, footage there. Um, and um, we'll be looking to see more tree yoga in the future. Uh, please hit subscribe and like if you would like to see more videos, Dachin's Daily Dharma, as well as tree yoga you can make some tree yoga love. comments below in the in the uh, comments section and um om shanti <laughs>